what up guys, this is Enigma Luigi. I'm here to uh, start out this level or this session with going to this level real fast. There's one thing I want to do so we can be able to get a jiggy out of the way. And in order to get the jiggy that's in a pterodactyl land, this is how you're supposed to do it. So just follow my lead and you'll be able to get it. And no problem. Let's activate this real fast. And so let's go through here. So how was your guys' day, huh? Mine's pretty good. Took a personal day off today, went to school. Yeah. It was alright. I wish I could have done something else besides going to school, but, you know, it's something that we need to do. If I can't remember, there might be a flight pad down here. Yep, just right there. Right there. Gonna... Oh shit! Whoops! That was a big glitch. I didn't expect it to happen like that. <laughs> oh my god, the first almost two minutes of this game and we died. <laughs> it's pretty cool. It's alright. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, in order to get that one jiggy that's uh, in Terry Dacolin, you're going to need to do this, and if you guys can remember that one place where that dinosaur is really, really thirsty, sorry, that dinosaur that's really, really thirsty, you're going to need to go through here to get the jiggy from him. I was walking on the icy side of Hellfire Peaks with my wife, Mildred, when a huge blizzard came along and blew me away. Why not stay up here? Lovely view. I'm afraid of heights now. I reckon I'm above the icy side, so if you could just give me a little push. Oh, I will. There you go, buddy. No! Oh shit. No, wrong side. Tell Medrid I love. <laughs> then he dies. Damn. That sucks. Someone's in the air. Defend your Jiggy at all costs. Screw you, Gruntilda. That's not what we're gonna, we're gonna do yet, but we'll get to it when we come back to this world. This isn't the world that I want to do, but I just want to get a few things out of the way from Terry Land. Right now, we're just gonna get one thing out of the way. And then, probably in the next couple episodes, we'll go get the what's needed to complete Pterodactyl Land. There you go. So after you do that, you just take the Kazooie torpedo out and voila. Where does it sleep? Pterodactyl Land. This is exactly where I, we wanted the water to come in. Oh, yippee, my pool is full of water. Where did it all come from? Mm -hmm. Yes, drink up, mm -hmm. buddy. Mmm, tastes heavily. Well, it did come from the clouds, did he? Did it? You said it would just drop, drop from the sky. I lie. Just drink it and be happy. Oh, I am. Here, take this odd-shaped gold tooth in exchange. There you go. 
we get a jiggy from him. I believe that puts us to nine in Pterodactyl Land. Yep, nine jiggies. I could get ten, but I don't really want to take all my time to, to doing it just yet. So like I said, within the next two, two or three episodes, or I'm gonna just wait till after I, uh, actually let's die. Just so we can get to the start. But, um, I wanna start with the next world just so we can get out of the way. And once I'm done with that, I might make another episode to go get that last jiggy. So. Because after the world that I want to do, we're going to go straight to Grunty's Industry just to get that out of the way. And then save that, um, this world that we just left from, for later. So yeah. Six minutes in already. Man, I hope this thing is not going to screw me over, man. I might have to do an update on my Pinnacle Studio. Uh, let's see, Clifftop. And I know that there's a few more jiggies that we need to collect too from Jolly Roger Bay, which is right here. But we can't do that just yet. We can get one here shortly doesn't really take that much time just to get what, what's needed. So that's not a problem. You can get one out of the way and then the last two when it's needed. Alright, so what I want to do here first... Let's see... Oh, I got it. Let's go through here because I'm gonna take the flight pad. I want to start this world off and fighting uh, one of the bosses. This is gonna be boss one. Speed up, turn left, and go through this little cave entrance right here. Yeah. This guy right here has got to be one of my favorite ones. Chili Billy, hot and spicy. Ah, at last, you must be the pizza delivery boy. No, just the local jiggy collectors. Lies, I bet. You've got my 12 foot spicy meat special on that back. Afraid not, Waterface. Then you'll eat. Uh, uh huh. So with this guy right here, you want to attack him with ice eggs. See? Brr, it's cold. Because with the ice eggs, it'll do damage to him. No other egg besides the ice egg is going to do any damage to this guy. And whenever you're done shooting, the cannons go down, you want to prepare yourself and jump away from the... from his teeth, or not his teeth, his tongue. Because then he'll lick the shit out of you. And if you jump and he manages to lick you, like, right here, then... it screws you up. Like, holy me, I've done that so many times where... He managed to get his tongue right on me while I jump, and I die. Like, dude. One more hit. And bam. Chili, or... What's his name? Uh, Chili Billy, I think? Forget about the pizza. I'm sure my brother still wants his. Two dragons are brothers, but they're different, um, how do you call it, attributes. One's fire, one's ice. I thought that was a pretty cool idea. 
So it makes me wonder, is like the mother and father freaking fire and ice dragons too, or do they come from like a hybrid dragon or both? I don't know. We'll find out. Alright, and there's one thing I want to do now since we're here. I believe there's something we can do right here with Banjo. I just don't remember if this area has the... What I want to do. Aw, oh, shit. I think I went down one step. Oops. Yeah, I went one step lower. Damn, dude, this thing is all freaking skipping on me. Uh, yeah, let's do this here. <clears throat> I just can't remember, if, like, what I want to do. I had to split Banjo and Kazooie up on the be from the beginning. Two, three, four, Yeah, you want to do this as quick as possible because this lava will literally kill you if you don't. Oh uh, shit. I should have done that. There you go. Oh. And there you go. We activated the platforms, but it doesn't really do anything, does it? I don't really remember. There you are. That's what we were looking for. Let's get this jiggy real fast and then we'll go get that honeycomb. And get the fuck out of here. Wait, what? Can I get him? Yep. <clears throat> if there's no way to get it, then might as well use a clockwork egg, right? Honestly, I love the, how the clock egg works, because if I didn't get that, I'm pretty sure I'd be stumped in trying to figure out exactly where from the ice side I had to come from. Because if you see the difference, the blue end is where it leads you to the, to the ice side of Hellfire Peaks. You go to the, <clears throat> the red side, it'll lead you back to this area. Which is the lava entrance. Lava side. I don't know if I have time for it, but we'll try it out. Because what I'm trying to do is get that move for Banjo. There's a move that Banjo can get in this world. And I don't remember precisely if I can do a split pad here to go get it. Oops, I should not have done that. Ah, oh, my finger. Damn, dude, what is up with my audio? So yeah, you just come through here. 
and activate this just in case he died. You want to split Banjo and Kazooie up and keep going up this way. Because right at the end of the. Oh, oops. Right at the end. Not up here. Damn it. Is it through here? No, it's not. It's through here. Now at least we didn't take a hit from falling, huh? Thank God for the fall proof. We'll come back for that now. We're here where the move is that I was telling you about. Get out of here, bug. You gotta get me at least 640 notes. Ah, I don't have enough. I'm off by 15. That sucks. First move that we cannot get because we don't have all the notes that are needed. Well, that's a bummer. At least we only need 10 more. That sucks. Sorry, Banjo. Um... Damn, bro. I'm trying to remember where there are 10 more notes that we can collect. Let's go back to Kazooie real fast. There should be notes that I can get. Oh man! Uh, at least we can come back over here instead of the beginning. That's one thing I love about the the split pads. Whenever you die, instead of having to start back from the beginning, you start back over here. Like, not over here, but you start back where you guys split off. So that's kind of a nice little tool. Damn, I'm sorry I'm not saying much, it's just I'm really stunned. But we managed to find 640 notes. So that means we can go back 